Very popular. See? But not with Henry. He still blamed me for not giving him the one thing he wanted. A son! There was worse to come. Thomas Wolsey. A man of the church. An advisor and close friend of Henry's. A very powerful and dangerous man. Henry was determined that he would end our marriage and find a new wife who would give him a son. He found his answer in the last place you would think. The Holy Bible. Leviticus verse 21. If a man shall take his brother's wife, it is an unclean thing. They shall be childless. Catherine married your brother Arthur first. So God has decided that you cannot have a son with her. I don't get it. We were married for over 20 years, and now he was using the words of the Bible to divorce me. And in the meantime, the two-faced dog was going out with a younger woman. Who was that? I'd rather not say. I think she means Anne Boleyn. Henry appealed to the most powerful man in the world for help. Lady Catherine, we have told the Pope in Rome that you are still refusing to leave Henry. So he has sent Cardinal Campeggio to help sort things out. I will never leave Henry. Oh, but you will. We are taking you to court. It's God's bidding. The church will decide in our favor. Henry got rid of Wolsey for not their sorting things out. But why do I have to take the blame? Well, it's God's bidding. Oof. Henry canceled our marriage and divorced me. The Pope was furious and booted him out of the Roman Catholic Church. I don't think Henry cared anymore. He simply started his own and called it the Church of England.